In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a bar setup. Let's unzip the three compression shot zip file downloaded from ARIA link and look inside this folder. So what we have is a readme and a samp and a folder for each sample. So let's look at this readme. First thing we're going to do is to create a bar setup for these three shots. So click the bar setups button, but first we need to select a working directory. So I'm going to select, you can make any, any directory you like. And this will be your workspace where all your data will be stored. You can create as many workspaces as you want to organize your stuff. So click the bar setups button to launch the, the bar creator window. You have a tab for the incident bar and a tab for the transmission bar. Looking at this readme, we see that our incident bar has these parameters. The speed limit is automatically calculated. So each the incident bar and the transmission bar has a strain gauge at 36 inches to the sample. And this strain gauge is defined here. So the first thing we're going to do is create the strain gauge. So we can call it um, omega. You know, or in 20 or something and resistance is 120 and then we have these parameters here so you can make a folder directory for your strain gauges I'm going to save this one into folder Omega. So after I create a string gauge I can add it to the bar so I get the same dialog except I can select one and add it 36 inches to the sample. So now I have an incident bar with all the parameters and a string gauge. I'll go to the transmission bar. I'm going to copy the parameters because they're all the same except for the Young's modulus which is 21.32 and then I'm going to add this string gauge at the same distance. So now I have a transmission bar and an incident bar with all the dimensions that I need. So this is a miraging steel setup so you might make a folder called steel and save this give it a name and save this into your steel folder. So we're done creating a bar, uh, bar setup and the next thing we're going to do is create a sample. 